सो हेलो गाइज एंड वेलकम टू माय चैनल टुडे अगेन आई एम बैक विथ अनदर इंपोर्टेंट न्यू मेरिकल्स ऑन पावर प्लांट डिजाइन से एंड हेयर यू कैन सी अ न्यूमेरिकल्स एंड दिस न्यूमेरिकल वाज वॉन्स आस्ट इन सिक्स इन फॉल एज वेल एज इन टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी इन फॉल एंड हेयर फ्रॉम द लो ड्यूरेशन कर्व फॉलोइंग डाटा आर अवेलेबल्स एंड द मैक्सिमम डिमांड ऑफ द सिस्टम्स इज ट्वेंटी फाइव मेगा वाट एंड द लोड इज सप्लाइड बाई टू जनरेटिंग यूनिट्स यूनिट वन इज ऑफ फिफ्टीन मेगा वाट एंड यूनिट टू ऑफ ट्वेल्व पॉइंट फाइव मेगा वाट एंड द यूनिट वन एक्स एज अ बेस लोड यूनिट एंड द यूनिट टू एज अ पिक लोड एंड द बेस लोड यूनिट ऑपरेट्स फॉर हंड्रेड परसेंट डेज ऑफ द टाइम वेल द पिक लोड यूनिट ऑपरेट्स फॉर फोर्टी परसेंट डेज ऑफ द टाइम से एंड द इनर्जी जनरेटेड बाई द यूनिट वन इज नाइनटी वन इंटू टेन पावर सिक्स यूनिट एंड डेट ऑफ यूनिट टू इज वन इंटू टेन पावर सेवन यूनिट्स and find the load factor plant capacity factors and plant use factor for unit 1 as well as the same data for unit 2 that is load factor plant capacity factor and plant use factor for unit 2 also and here in the question the maximum demand is given as 25 megawatt and for base load unit it is given as 15 megawatt as unit 1 is a 15 megawatt and unit 2 is a 12.5 megawatt given sir so base load unit is to be 15 megawatt and peak load unit 2 is 12.5 megawatt and the energy generated base load is 91 since 91 into 10 power 6 unit is given is given for unit 1 and similarly 1 into 10 power 6 units given for unit 2 so we have energy generated by base load is 91 into 10 power 6 unit similarly for energy generated by peak load is 1 into 10 power 7 units now here and uh, first we have to calculate the load factor plant ones and plant one is of a base uh, for base load so plant So sorry, load factor for plant one will be energy produced during the year by maximum demand into means this time period means eight seven six zero since we are calculating annually. So energy generated during the year during the year for plant one is given as here ninety one is written by six unit. So ninety one is written by six unit is written here and maximum demand. Now here one thing you have to notice here the for and here the maximum demand will be the base load unit of one means fifteen megawatt. So don't try to use this maximum demand means 25 megawatt. So base, since we are calculating for base load, so we'll use the maximum demand for base load. So base load unit is 15 megawatt. So we'll use the maximum demand as 15 into 10 power 3. So our load factor will be 0.6926. And here, since there is no reserve capacity for plant one, so capacity factor will be directly the load factor. So we have just calculated the load factor 0.6926. So the like capacity factor will be the value of load factor, and that is zero point six nine two six. And also here, since the low, since the plant has been running for a whole year, that is eight seven six zero hours continuously, the plant use factor is the same as the plant capacity factors or the load factors. So similarly, the plant use factor will be also the same value as the plant capacity factors. So it will be zero point six nine two six, and it in percentage will get here sixty nine point two six percentage. Now for plant two, since plant two plant two is for peak load, so plant two supplies the remaining load. The maximum demand on it is twenty five minus fifteen. Since for plant one it was fifteen megawatt, and the maximum demand is twenty five, so for plant two it will be twenty five minus fifteen, that is ten megawatt, and it runs for forty percent of the years, and its capacity is given as twelve point five megawatt. So load factor will be so load factor energy generated upon T. So energy generated for plant two is one into ten power six upon T. Now in place of time period, we, since it is forty percent of the it, it runs for forty percent of the year. So in place of T, we will use zero point four into eight seven six zero. And here the demand is ten megawatt. So it ten megawatt. So ten into ten power six will will use here. So our load factor will be zero point two eight five three. Now in order to calculate the annual plant capacity factors. So annual plant by so annual plant capacity factors here we have the formula as the for plant capacity factors L average upon rated capacity and L average means energy generated upon T so energy generated is one into ten power six and in place of T you have eight seven six zero and the rated capacity is here the capacity is given as twelve point five megawatt so here the load uh, sorry its capacity will be twelve point five megawatt so twelve point five into ten power three in kilowatt so we get here zero point zero nine one three And the plant use factor will be energy generated is one into ten power six, one into ten power seven upon and rated capacity. Rated capacity is here twelve point five since it is given rated as twelve point five megawatt, so twelve point five into ten power three. And again, our means and here we'll use the number of operating hours and number of operating hours will be forty percent of the years. So in year we have eight seven six zero and we have to use the forty percent. So zero point four into eight seven six zero. So we get the plant use factor as zero point two two eight four. Now 
in order to calculate the annual load factor for the whole system sir. so energy generated for plant 1 plus energy generated for plant 2 upon the maximum demand is 25 megawatt so 25 into 10 by 3 and for uh, and in place of time period since we are calculating annually so we will use 8760 so finally we will get the load factor for the whole system as 0 0.4612 so in this we can calculate the numericals hope you enjoy the lecture sir thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel thank you